It is now my privilege to announce the, the Director's Teaching Prizes. SOAS's reputation is built not only in our world-leading research, but on the quality of our teaching. To our graduates, we hope that when you remember SOAS, you will always appreciate those teachers who were open doors to, to new ideas, who challenged and inspired you, and who enabled you to find new ways of looking at the world. On behalf of the school, I would like to thank all my colleagues, lecturers, tutors, and, and, and support staff who gave their best to, to enable you to, to realize your ambitions. The Director's Teaching Prize is one of the most important awards that we make. And this year, we have taken nominations in three categories. And I will tell you briefly about all of the winners before inviting them up to um, receive their award. In the category of innovative and inspirational teaching, we have three joint winners. The winners are Professor of Political Economy, Alfredo Sadfilo, Senior Lecturer in the History of African Art, Dr. Charles Gore, Head of the Department of Languages and Cultures of the Near and Middle East, Professor Stefan Spurl. So why were these colleagues awarded the prize? We saw clear signs of an exceptional commitment to students. And this ranged from helping students who had a range of problems to go on to succeed providing the spark that encouraged students to continue for, to further study, to masters or to PhD, or generally being a catalyst that engendered a love of a particular subject. In the nominations, there were wonderful, heartfelt comments, and I've chosen just a few short ones to give you a feeling. Dr. Gore was described as an amazing teacher. Professor Spurl, a... a magician, and Professor Saad Filao simply as the boss. <laughs> the second category is for teaching fellows and graduate teaching assistants, and the award goes to Frido Venton in the Department of Development Studies. Frido's nominations showed a sound pedagogical base and an impressive student in engagement. And more than that, he received 18 separate student nominations, an exceptional number. Finally, the award for support staff goes to four joint winners. Lisa McSweeney from the Faculty of Languages and Cultures, Jack Footit from the Faculty of Law and Social Sciences, Nita Haynes from the Faculty of Arts and Humanities, and widening participation officer, Sarah Tucker. In considering this award, the panel focused on the enhancement of the student experience and the impact on student retention and student success. We felt that all four had demonstrated an exceptional contribution. We would now like to invite those winners that are present to come forward and receive their award. Dr. Charles Gore. <laughs> Professor Stefan Spurl. Frido Venton. Lisa McSweeney. Jack Footit. Tucker. I am D 
delighted that we've been able to honour our teaching at this moment because graduation itself relies on the on the found on the foundation of excellent and inspiring teaching. Long may this continue.